One of the strongest moves you can make is deploying AI models on-prem in your own systems. That means the model is running inside your firewall, on your servers, on your terms, subject to all of your company's technical controls. Yeah, and that's kind of the ideal world, right? No data is going to leave your network at all. No cloud vendor with some kind of fuzzy privacy policy is going to take all of that data. It's just complete control. Yeah. However... We also understand that AI models right now take a whole lot of firepower, and there's not a lot of companies that are going to have just, I guess, some graphics processors on top of graphics processors that they can run their own local AI. Things are changing so fast that that's going to be out of date in like a week. So there's not true things that we can do right now to say, hey, host it all yourself. You're going to be an AI company now. We recognize that that's really not the thing that you truly can do. So not today as of this recording, right? But look at how DeepSeek made so many waves just a few weeks ago. The reason why they were making so many waves is that DeepSeek performed really well in a lot of performance benchmarks without requiring the same processing power as a lot of the a lot of the other models. So DeepSeek also kind of failed on a lot of uh, security points. So I wouldn't take that as like your gold standard, but I do think that we're seeing efficiency as a key competitive mechanism in the large language model market, which is really interesting. 